Well, here we have another installment of Let's Tidy Up These Locks. Evan, my client, works in construction and he puts his hair up all the time. So they start to grow together like this. It's pretty intense how much they try to coil in with each other. And it's been a couple of months since his last maintenance and his last deep wash. So first I have to go through and separate everybody so that I can open up the scalp as much as possible and so that the water doesn't intensify all of the locking up that his hair is trying to do at the root. You can see all of the bits of construction site that gets into his hair. There's skin from it being so locked up together that the skin can't release. Then there's all this drywall dust. There's paint in his hair. First, I'm gonna rinse it. Then I'm gonna get a heavy dose of shampoo all over his scalp, scrubbing and just trying to get the skin removed off of his scalp, which then moves it into the transition area, which I'm starting to work here. This area is where the most buildup is. Kind of like a pimple. Mmm, yummy. Look at that water. Ugh. This is the second go around of scrubbing the transition area. Everything that I just rinsed out went straight into that area on his hair. But here you see, we got them clean. And this is uh, really physically intensive. His hair is now dry and I'm going in with the maintenance. Excuse my appearance, I wasn't planning on recording a video today and I'm just all up in the world with my overalls. First, I'm gonna uh, crochet his hair. That's gonna help the root um, get into position for locking. And it also creates a nice base for what I'm doing now, which is pulling his loose hairs in straight into that base that I created with the crochet. So this tool here is my um, latch hook tool. And I just go through the hair pretty quickly pulling all those loose ones in all the way down to the front where he has some pretty wild little gray hairs that don't love to stay in yet until they get a little longer. But you can see his grid is coming back and being more defined. Everybody's getting put in their place where they belong. He's in a lot of discomfort at this point and he's pretty much over it. Give him a little clean up on his beard and his sides. And here we have the finished product. Aren't they gorgeous? All clean and separated, no more buildup. His scalp looks very healthy. Dreads are uniform. I created these about 10 or so years ago and I love them. Thanks for watching guys.